Hey guys, Dano from Parface Powers here. Uh, find ourselves at Naruma today. Played here before, second time playing it. First hole, par four, 398 metres. Straight down the middle, so yeah, good drive. Leave yourself with a short iron in. Kind of like just below my feet where it's All right, hole two, par four, 330 meters. Um, I'm just gonna let the hole speak for itself, enjoy. Bit of cart cam. Um, very disappointed with that missed birdie opportunity, but my putting stays genuine. Genuinely terrible. On to the next one. What a call, say. What a call. Uh, let's try and get this on the green. How is this course? Pretty unreal. Long part, that's not good. First par three at Naruma, beautiful hole, um, tiny green, so let's, let's see how we go. Not a great shot, not a great shot, but look at this. It went over. Look at this. How's that? How's this for tea? Back to party. Nice. Lighting's back. Uh, hole four, par four. 
uh, 368 meters. I genuinely thought this was a dog leg right. So as you can see, it's dead straight. So you're about to watch me think I've hit a perfect drive. Should be pretty perfect, I think. Uh -oh. Tell you what, your thins are playing off well. I'm not hitting the ball well, am I? Mm. My contact. Mm. Looks like I've got a chip off. Thing is not bad. Okay, fifth hole, par five, uh, 458 meter. It's actually rated as one of the easier holes on the course. So let's see how I find it. Absolutely skied my driver here, so made this par five a very long hole. Gonna go. This could go long. There's a bit of wind too. I think it's straight. I've read it as straight anyway. And I pulled it. Damn it. Hole six, par four, 311 meter. Um, just a straight and short fairway. Oh, 
Oh, Dana, that's brilliant. <laughs> What'd you do, the Toyota jump? <laughs> what a feeling. <laughs> Bloody great drive. All right, hole seven, par four, 424 meter. It's not really that long of a hole if you get your good drive away. Um, it's a very steep downhill. Um, you'll find on this course, a lot of the fairways are blind tee shots. So just be prepared for that. What are we thinking so we don't hit the caravan park? Yeah. <laughs> Soft. <laughs> Smooth. It's in a bad lie, which is annoying. Soft and smooth worked out pretty well. Yeah, I was a bit scared of that to be honest. <laughs> Eighth hole, par four, 317 metre. Um, tee shot, you're hitting over water for this and there are bunkers pretty much in driving range. Um, other than those two things, it's a pretty straightforward hole. All right, more cart cam. So the thing that I actually love about the Naruma course is the first First, or the front nine I should say, is all kind of beach um, with the water views and everything. And then you kind of come across this way to the bushland. It looks like a lot of people lay up on here from the Divot Mark. Hmm. They're not about that long. No. Driving the green. A little bit sketchy. <laughs> I thought I was, was going to crash off the bridge. Alright, I've gone in the bunker, so best of luck to me. I'm yet to get a good bunker shot, so. <laughs> Putting. <laughs> oh. We're not putting. Turns out 
melt party. So <laughs> good, good distance. Broke more. Ninth hole, uh, par three, fairly long par three with the water on the left. Tee box is fairly tight with trees on the right. It's a good way to finish the, um, the, the front nine. So this one plays 170. What do you use it? Six, but we'll see. Just off line, right distance. Tenth hole, par four, 320 metres. Um, another tee shot across water. Bunkers on both sides at about driving distance. Um, this is probably up there with my favourite holes on the course. Of all the holes, start recording. Hmm? I want to talk about this hole. Oh. Cameraman. I've already spoken about the hole. <laughs> Beautiful hole. It's got kind of that Augusta feel. Bonville. Yeah. Likes find the bunch Should today, right. but it bounced out. Yeah. I don't think it went in, I think it yeah, come around the top. So just a quick update on the turn is I am currently four over, so 39 par 50, uh, 35. So yeah, could crumble, could come through right, with the that. biscuits. Find it. Probably want to hit it. This might be long, but I think I'd rather be long than short. Get it up there. That'll be pretty good, hopefully. Again, beautiful hole, but look at this. Plugged right next to it, spun back, 30. See if he's uh, jinxed himself. Really straight.
Right. Sorry, pal. Birdie, baby. <laughs> uh, hole 11, uh, par five, 460 meters. It's a pretty elevated tee box. Um, huge dog leg left with an inside bunker. <laughs> I've, honest, I've played a lot of like top rated courses and honestly I don't think this is rated high enough like you just yeah look at it look at it I just got so lucky. You got like ricocheting off a tree to the fairway. <laughs> that was a shocker. Not to mention the boat. After a terrible tee shot. Got lucky, hit these trees, come on the fairway. But I'm a mile, mile from the hole. I'm not a lucky bounce though. Can't get two good ricochets in a row. Mm. Guess he did get a lucky ricochet. Not really. I come into this tree and it's somehow come down. What are you gonna do? You need to get it on the green. Damn it. Yeah, what I just did. Yeah. Do the same. Copy the same thing. Don't overthink it. Copy it down. Quarter of an inch out, mate. Oh. Well, after a wonderful birdie, I get my first double with a three putt. <laughs> Righto, hole 12, um, par four, 333 metre. Dam on the left, um, pretty narrow fairway off the tee box, uh, but other than that, pretty straightforward, um, simple par four. Oh, that sounded sweet. Oh. Claw the score back a little bit.
It's all right. You want to take the uh, water drop? Hey? You want me to count the water drop? There's only one. Do I count it though? It's up to you. Uh, hole 13, par 4, 369 metre. It's one of the harder rated holes on the course with water on the left as you come over this blind hill. Fairly tight fairway once you get down there. Um, it's a pretty challenging hole, it's a fun hole. Should be pretty good. Should be pretty good. <laughs> I'm in a mind frame at the moment of saving my score. But saving our heads, we could have ridden the bell, huh? Yeah. How? Well, it's quite loud. <laughs> it's bizarre though because how many blind fairways are there? Blind tee shots, and they've, this is the first one to have a belt. Uh, hole 14, par 3, 169 metre, fairly straightforward. Uh, another small green, which I've noticed has been most par 3s, um, actually most of Naruma, small green, so makes it a bit challenging. Well done, Nicky. Well done. Well Oh. <laughs> that was darn close. Ah. Come on in or you'll make me scared the other way for you. Oh. 
They're up. Two two on my Z. Quite hard enough. Oh, bloody hell. Putting, putting, putting. Hole 15, par 5, 344 metre. Um, tee shot over the water again. Um, fairly wide fairway and plenty of greenside bunkers. Maybe I won't be going swimming as much as I think. Shouldn't have said that. <laughs> um, all right. Yeah, you. Great hit. Shit, boy, that's a great hit. Mm. That is unfortunate. Hole 16, par 5, 427 metre. Should be able to hit up to the bend up here. Um, bunk is either side of that fairway, but once you've got to that bend, it's a fairly straight shot um, at the green with some green side bunkers again. Way. Yeah, way. About time you guys performed. Oh, yeah. We've all lost it. Save the hole. I mean, that's pretty much saved it, isn't it? <laughs> After the world's worst drive. <laughs> you watch me miss this now. I don't know why I was so nervous about that part. 
Quick update, we've got two holes to go. I have remained parless for the back nine, so that's fun. But managed to get away with two birdies, so let's see if I can keep this as a single digit round. Hole 17, par three, 129 metre uphill fairway with a um, with a, quite a small green again. Green side bunkers, uh, but look at the view when you get over the hill. And then coming back cross bridge. This is a bit risque. I'm going a, a 50 degree. I think it's the club. Meanwhile, nine for me. That's good, good, but good. not for me. Oh, that's still miss. Drained it. Don't need your goods. Righto, on to the 18th, par five, 450 metre. Um, what a hole to finish on. Uh, you should be able to get get your drive pretty much right to this corner here, um, which leaves you with a short hit to the green. Um, and again, coming around that bend, look at that. It's, it's pretty special. And you get down. So, fun little fact. That cove just over there. Yeah, yeah it is. is that the one? Yeah. That's the one, yeah. I mean, I knew that. <laughs> That's where I proposed to my now wife, mother of my children, child even. That cove, pretty cool. The Serenis might ask. And now you're about to witness history, of course, right? what it's like such a, my proposal bay. <laughs> Currently nine over, down the 18th. I haven't put it OB, which I was very nervous about. Could happen, just saying, it could happen. Is, is he going for glory or playing it safe? I'm gonna go for it. If I was wearing my Apple Watch, it'd be telling me to calm down. Don't know. <laughs> oh, that's going to be a TBD. I think the nerves are starting to kick in. Mm. Oh, 
a lot of crosswind oh. up here. Hmm. Uh, I'm joking. I'm further. Alright. You kind of have to on a par 5 when you're 160 from the green. You kind of have to go for it. I went for it. Paid the price. Water ball. Water ball. Um, I can still up down for a par. That's pretty much the goal here. Up down for a par. Damage control. It's good. partable, it's partable. If it was going to keep rolling, I was going to say you might not even have to up down. Yeah, imagine if I chipped in 30. God. Ah, oh, well, it is what it is. All right, shot uh, an 82, so 10 over today at Naruma. Um, beautiful course, definitely recommend it. Uh, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe. We've got some big things coming up, so very excited to share it with you.